Hey guys, Dovestorm here, and I have my cute new little pet Pikachu. I just got him yesterday. I got you. Alright, Pikachu. Uh, go back there with the uh, last, with the last blind, eBay blind, but, um, opening stuff. Pika. Um, I actually got him at Publix. Uh, my friend introduced me to a section of the store that I had never been to before. And I'll probably go there every time now. Yay. More Pikachus, yeah! Anyway. So, I got this box today. I'm not gonna show you the entire... There. This box. Which you can't really see because it's huge. And I actually moved my laptop from the desk so that we'd have room to open the box on camera and see what I got. Because honestly, I've ordered quite a few things and I don't remember what would be in here. There's only two things I can think of at the moment. Because it's obviously not my Philippines blind random lot. Because it's the box is too small. And, uh, see, the box is too small. So either one, it's the black and white cat, short hair cat that I ordered, or two, it's those three kittens I ordered. That's the only thing I can think of. It can't be the collie because the auction on that doesn't close until tomorrow, so I won't even know if I get it yet. My first auction. All right, we got the scissors. Move uh, Mabel back there with the others, and let's uh let's open this thing. This is hard. There we go. Okay, do the other side and these are old scissors I use them for like everything mainly the cut stuff like cardboard right. so now put it this way or this way I wonder what it is, guys. Come on in. Ow! I myself. Well, on the red side, doesn't look like it scraped off any skin. That's good. Oh no! But. Some of my pets were about to fall. Alright. Oh, another thing that it could be. It could be my duplicate of this one that I ordered. Because I want to keep one and then give the other one to Breakneck Werewolves. So, let's see what I got. Are you kidding me? This is taped more. I can't take more tape. There we go. I'm pretty sure this is the three kittens thing because it's in the bubble wrap I can play around with. Oh no, it's not. Weird. Be kindly. Well, I have some bubble wrap to play with. And, um, Dee Dee's Finds USA. Thank you very much for your order. Your. Uh, it's like not focused. Your, or, your business is appreciated. Any comments or questions, please contact me through eBay. 
Okay. So, I have a new box for pet shop stuff. Some bubble wrap to mess around with later. And... Oh wait, there were three other kittens that I uh, ordered. And one of them came separate from the other two. So that might be this one. Oh wait, no, this is the three kittens. They're all wrapped in one. This was the three kittens I was talking about. So they're all wrapped up. Alright, now let's see the first one. So the first one we have is this cute little orange kitten with green eyes. And it looks a lot like Cutie from back when, before I even started making vi these videos. I used to play around and pretend I was making videos and it is hard to get her to turn her head like I can't get her to turn her head around to how like this one has it so I don't know these might end up being like fakes or it could just be really rusted um who knows Ugh. there got it somewhat fixed it like the head won't go certain ways for some reason I don't know it's, well they are old because they're like generation two or series two whatever they're called of pet shops but it's like hard to tell because I don't know if these are fake or not and then they have like these stuck necks, so I don't know. The head is definitely not squishy. See, head's not squishy. So I'll just put you there next to Pikachu. All right, so the next one is this really cute one. I actually, cute pet shop kitten that I saw actually a few days ago. I was watching a video called Lost Lovers. It was a Valentine's Day episode. This was the kitten they used. Ugh. Why is my background focused and not the foreground? Like, seriously. Focus on the kitten. Ugh, whatever. But, let's see. It's hard to tell because the camera won't focus. what I get my phone won't focus correctly and these won't this camera won't focus correctly just great so that means that next time I should have the background closer when I start recording yeah so yeah And then this is the one that I showed the pic I showed the pictures to Breakneck and she absolutely loved it. This little uh smoky gray kind of it kind of looks white with darker dark gray tipped ears. And then normally I don't like to order white pet shops because I mess around with dirty stuff with like stuff that can make them dirty. And I already have a white cat that got damaged because I would mess around with pens a lot. So she got all scraped up and messy. So yeah. Alright. Well, that's all my pets that I got today um like I said I still have uh the so I was wrong before when I said those were the only kittens and then the black and white cat were the only things I was expecting uh, like I said earlier when I was uh changing what I had said uh I did order another one of this one to uh so that i'll have one to give to Faye, Faye, uh or breakneck werewolves 
whichever one is in better condition, I will give to her. Unless the other one is in just, like, trashy condition. In which case, I will customize it into her OC Jenna. Like I originally planned. Before, this one turned out to be super adorable and in almost perfect condition. It has a couple blemishes here and there, but it is perfect otherwise. Oh, also, I shaked the camera back, so sorry. Uh, I have named, I have named it, this one. This one shall be Thorn. Unless I end up with the other one, in which case the other one will be, that looks just like it, will be named Thorn. The point is I'll have this pet shop and it'll be named Thorn. Or this, um, kind of pet shop. That particular husky. Um, this one still does not have a name, sadly, and I'm gonna move the camera forward. There. So yeah, this, um... This dog that I got as a bonus pet with the sunglasses. Oh, I also ordered some more accessories that come with bonus dog pets. I hope I get five bonus pets since it said I'd get one bonus dog with the one order. And I ordered five of those uh, packs. So maybe I'll get five. Hopefully I get five um bonus dogs that'll be five pets for like free for ordering those accessories um and then this one i don't have a name for yet because um breakneck has this one and she named it uh i don't remember what she named him so i don't know what i'll name it um, I'll think of something. I might just go ahead and try to name him after Holy Roman Empire from Hitalia. Uh, because honestly, Rome sounds like a cute name. Yeah, Rome. Uh, I don't know. I'll think about it. I might just end up naming him after my little, um, OC, but I don't know. No, because that one's a girl. Oh, never mind. Yeah, I don't know what I'm going to name him. Oh, well. And then, like I said, there's Pikachu. And then we have these three, which I ran out of space. Move these little storage things so I can move it over. And these are the new ones that I just got today. And these are causing shadow. Oh, sorry. And, uh, I can kind of think of some names for them. Like, uh, this one I'm going to name Lovi, which honestly is short for Lovino, which is, uh, Romano from Hitalia's human name. But at the same time, Lovi sounds like it could be a girl or a boy name. A kind of unisex name like Thorn. I don't know. Lil V just sounds adorable. So yeah, this one's name is Lil V. This one, um, let's see, what's the name I haven't used yet? Hmm. I'm going to call her Fiona for now because I don't think I named any after the Shrek characters. Or any Disney princesses for that ma matter. Huh. So yeah, I'll name her Fiona. And then this little one. I don't know. What should I name him? I, I'm kind of tempted to name him Jack Frost. Because I can't name him Zane. Because Zane is my Great Dane. Or my White Great Dane. Or Light Gray, I guess. Because his paws are white. I painted his paws white. Um... It can't be Zeke, because Zeke has brown eyes, and... Oh, it can't be Jack Frost. Jack Frost has uh, blue eyes. Darn it. Um, 
I'll come up with something for that little boy. Little boy. I assume it's a boy because there's no eyelashes. But, um, just like with Levy, or Lovey, why did I say Levy? Just like with Lovey and Thorn, I'll probably give it a unisex name. Because kittens, just like with the husky, with my huskies, I have very few of. And most of my kittens I have at my grandmother's house are customized or not the right color for anything. So I don't have a white kitten. I technically also don't have a white ultra pet, just the Siamese that's, that's white and black. Which I could use a gray kitten for if I had a gray one. I just have, the closest I have to gray is a black kitten that is a plag custom. Miraculously, but, and I keep him in a little container that I got from one of those little machines that you put a quarter in and you turn the, uh, thing, the little knob thing. And you get a little prize in this little, oh, um, container thing. I put him in that container thing to keep him from chipping. I wish I had a bigger one of those or that they came bigger so that I could protect Chat Noir the same way because now I have to fix his hair. Yay me. But yeah. So we'll move you for now. So we have three pets that need names, and then um, Fiona, Lovi, Pikachu, and Dorn. Oh, also Pikachu needs a name, because I can't just call her Pikachu or him Pikachu to make it a he, because I don't have that many boy characters. Also, I need to take pictures of my pet shops that are either completed customs or just regular LPS that I have. I'll need to take pictures of them. And then what I'll do is put them up on my computer and put in their names because I keep forgetting what names I have already. I mean, sure, there could be some with the same name, but I just don't like that. And I don't want to name any new characters after ones I'm going to customize. Because I'm going to customize characters based on certain things. Like, for example, let me move this. Oh, where is it? Oh, there they are. Okay. Yeah. So these are some drawings I did of customs I want to do for pet shops. So let me move them here. So first we have Dove Storm, what I want to make her. Now normally I make her a cat because Dove Storm was originally a kitty cat. And heck, my mascot originally was a purple cat, which I then customized and now I have to repaint her. So, I'll probably repaint her to look like this. Unless I get a cute enough husky. Then I will do this. So, yeah. And then this was her cutie mark for her pony form. Because she does have a pony form. For the pic, which is the icon for my YouTube channel. Or just my YouTube account. And then this was the first one I drew, actually. Uh, as far as the new ones, I have some old pictures that I drew as well. But this is Lucy Grenay. She is a Ninjago OC that I have. I never made her as a Lego minifigure because I realized it was really hard to paint uh, minifigures. So to paint her a outfit or like to give her the right look that she has it it would have been hard just 
just hard. And plus, it's using my brother's uh, Legos. So, I would have to... The only reason I even know that it's hard to paint these is because my brother wanted me to do a Tyler ninja suit. Which I still don't have done. It, it's coated in blue, but light blue, but that, that's it. But yeah, um, I also plan to make this green scarf that she will wear a lot. And I know I draw a lot of short hair kitty cats, but that's just because I really like the cats and stuff. And here's another cat. This one is for Trixie. I always wanted her to be a cat. Um, I'm not really sure why, but, uh, I made, like, six characters for my, um, outcast thing. It was originally five characters, but I wanted a sixth one just to fit in a MLP base I have, and also to go with how this works. Wait. No, I actually originally had six. I just made the seventh one for the cast. The original six were Trixie, Heart, Angel, the rock star that I never actually named, and Bubblegum, Pli Bubble Bubblegum Bliss. Yeah, that was hard to say. Bubblegum Bliss. And Twig. Now, the pop star that I still don't have a name for, he's got, like, rainbow ears. Well, th in the pony version, he had rainbow hair. But he has uh, rainbow ears in the LPS custom I did. And he, Bubblegum Bliss, and Twig are all dog pet shops. So I wanted to avoid dogs as much as possible. And I wanted to change them to be the same uh, species. So Heart and Angel are both deer. Which will be a pain to find if I don't get them in any of the random lots. Because I will go through all three random lots I ordered. All 60 LPS. And... I told Breakneck I was giving her 20 of those pet shops because uh, the most recent two I ordered are supposed to be one for me and one for her, but I have to go through them first because I need base figures for these. And the two that I most recently ordered are from China, so there's a chance they'll be fake. The other one I ordered was from Philippines. And then we also have Starlight Glimmer, who is a cat, just like Trixie. I really like customizing cats. This is why fakes are important, because people get on to me for customizing short hairs and destiny cats. Okay, I never actually uh, did a destiny cat. The only cat I customed besides short hairs was the sitting down cat. It was a gray one. I She was messed up. And the only reason I customized those short hairs and the gray sitting down cat was because when I was younger and the Comic-Con exclusive pet had recently come out, I think. I don't know when it came out. I was too young to go to the Comic-Con anyway to get it. And I didn't even know it existed at the time. But I was watching YouTube and I found an LPS series with two sisters. And one of them became a superhero. And she had the... And her superhero form was the uh, Comic-Con exclusive pet. Which I fell in love with. So, being the creative kid I was, and probably still am, even though I'm 18, I took some pens and 
and some nail polish and I tried to make my pet shops my own and make them into superheroes. I also took Sharpies to do this, which is also why Bubblegum Bliss, the figure, the base figure I used for that one was used because I had taken Sharpie, drew a mask and gloves and boots onto it and colored it in with pink highlighter on a blue pet shop. I obviously was not color coordinated back then. But anyway, I just realized I made pink superhero outfit on a light blue pet shop and it looked terrible. But then when I make it into a custom, I make it a fully pink dog with blue paws and hair. I think it was blue paws. No, it was a lighter pink paws and lighter pink ears. With the dark blue was on the hair and the tail. Yeah, I believe that was it. Because the pony character is a hot pink stallion with blue hair, mane and tail. And he's a blank flink, which is why he's an outcast. Heart and Angel, obviously, are changelings that disobeyed Chrysalis back before the changelings all reformed themselves by sharing love at the end of season six. Yay. I mean, I don't have a problem with that, but at the same time I kind of do because on one hand... It's great that the changelings are no longer evil, with the exception of Chrysalis. And it's great that they no longer look all creepy. But on the other hand, they look like a rainbow threw up on them, honestly. Like, Bill Cipher came in, exploded, and then, um... Shortly after killing a rainbow rainicorn or something. And for those of you who probably don't know, and I'm surprised I even know this, a rainicorn is basically some creature from Adventure Time that is basically a rainbow and a unicorn. I think. That's what Lady Rainicorn looks like. Okay? She looks. Like someone took a Rambo and a unicorn and smooshed them together. I just realized this eBay unboxing video turned into me ranting about pony characters. What is wrong with my life? Uh, anyway, I should probably go. I am almost at my 30 minute limit that I give myself for each episode. So, yeah. Um, I introduced you to... These are all named. These need names. And if by my next video they are named, I will let you know. So, yeah. I'm Dove Storm. Signing out. Bye.